colorful YouTubers to How To with M2. This video will be discussing if colors were numbers. Most of us will remember this colorful chart from early on in grade school, our primary and secondary colors. In horse racing in North America, with very few exceptions, red, white, and blue represent one, two, and three. Technically, black is not a color. Black is the absence of all colors, such as a black hole in space that sucks out all the color. White also is not a color. White is the combination of all colors together. With that, white or black, depending on how you're looking at it, will represent zero. You should be aware that there is a universal standard for zero. Of course, the slash through the zero or a longer slash through the zero. I once knew an accountant that would put a big thick horizontal line through the zero. However, an O is symmetrical as a circle where a zero is elongated. And again, this is a universal standard to tell a zero from an O. Now back to color. Would you believe that all of these hearts are the exact same color? Well, they are. It's the lines and the contrast that tricks our eyes into seeing the hearts as different colors. As you can see, the lines themselves are different colors, which creates a contrast to trick our eye and mind into believing they are different colors. Our amazing brains more than anything else sense contrast. Our brains also run very slightly behind. The extended part of this rotating line is blinking directly in line with the primary line. But to our brains, it appears that the blinking line is somewhat behind the primary line. Our amazing brains have three different color receptors. And these receptors are excited by their specific color or combination of colors. So what happens is the more a color receptor fires, it becomes, if you would, acclimated and therefore not as sensitive to specific colors. For our newly proposed universal standard, I think we can all be in agreement that red is number one. And since white is not a color, yellow will be number two. Then of course, blue being number three. Now, green would be number four. And as we follow along the primary and secondary color chart, orange is number five which leaves purple as number six. Now it gets a little bit tricky. Seven will be represented by pink or dark pink. Eight by silver or gray. And of course, gold follows silver. So number nine is gold or a brown-ish gold. Now you may be thinking that this just doesn't seem important, but let me tell you, it is. In electronics with multicolored wiring and circuitry, and also if you consider filing, whether it be triage, or just a busy office environment. Standardization of color
colors as it relates to numbers and priority is important. As the M2 technology proposal for a standardization of colors and numbers goes to the National Institute of Standards and Technology in Maryland, just remember you are all part of it and your comments are more than welcome. Be sure to visit the NIST website at NIST. T.gov. If you love karaoke as much as my friends and I do, you should give Mark the Mixer a try. Along with M2 Technology and Karaoke King, you will have the singing sensational time of your life. Music entertainment way better than you can possibly imagine.